Everything sound good, Tony? All right. Oh, he was upstairs. Here's a song by Hall and Oates. Yeah. yeah. Nice. Sounds like a trucking company, Hall and Oates. Sarah, Sarah, 
Sarah. It sounds good up here. <laughs> oh man, I'm having a blast. <laughs> so what we we play cover tunes our own way pretty much. And then we like to do things where we just kind of make up a song on the spot. And we never know where it's going to go. I think we need, I'm, I'm a little tense right now. I think we should just, we should do that and kind of loosen up. Is, is it cool if we just make something up? Yeah. Okay.
So we're going to call that Moldy Potato Salad. That's the name of that song. That sounds like a perfectly appropriate name for that. That's about right. It was made from all the leftovers in my brain. <laughs> I think it's Steely Dan time. Some Steely Dan? Yeah. I do want to remind you guys that my new CD that features Matt heavily, uh, it's not even a CD, sorry. It's a stream down, it's not even a download, it's just streaming <laughs> on Spotify and Amazon and Apple Music. It came out on my birthday, this Thursday. And uh, yeah, so I had a birthday, an awesome induction into the Hall of Fame, and the album came out all on the same day. I think I should play the lottery this week. I think so. So here, here's Home at Last by Steely Dan. Thank you. 
to have minimal technical difficulties today. Poor Matt had to throw a rig together because he couldn't <laughs> fly with all the stuff he normally uses. I think it came together well. Yeah, I'm happy, man. I'm happy. <laughs> 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 Let 
Let me just test out this thing one more time here. Check one more two. Yeah. Okay, now it's working. Oh, I see what I've got. Okay. That's, that's what it is. I think it's like uh, feedback from the mic, and it's like... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's always a problem. I think so, honey. What's going on? What's going on? 
See, the fun part about playing with Daryl and this, this, this little duo thing we've been doing is that we neither one really know exactly 100% what we're going to do. It's just kind of... It's as much as a surprise to me as it is to y'all. So I'm, I'm just kind of... I'm just happy when we get to the end of the song and it sounded like music the whole time, or at least most of the time. That's what makes it fun. <laughs> we don't know yeah. what we're doing. Yeah. I mean, we do. But we do. All right, we had some dancers, so this is a good one to dance to if you want to get your groove on. Whoa! 
ask you has been the kind of person that you really are now. Ooh, I'll be good. Don't you know I just wish I could? so much everybody okay since we got since we're in the funk mood now we're gonna, gonna do some Stevie Wonder to do some stuff hopefully during the during the break. Keep on 
Eastern Tennessee, that's yeah. Matt Baxley on the keyboards and vocals. Here's a tune by the great Bobby Caldwell. I do want to thank my musician friends from 30 some years ago, my high school friends from 30 some years ago for coming out. I really appreciate you guys. Love you guys. Thank you. I mean, we're all in our 30s now, right? Did I do that wrong? So I failed eight grades. What's the big deal?
Hey, that's a Buffalo Hall of Famer right there, Grover Washington Jr. Right. Along with Daryl Nutt on the drums. 
It is a great honor to be part of the class of 2022. I graduated twice, I guess. <laughs> We're going to do an instrumental by... Uh, The meters in New Orleans. Yeah, let's go to New Orleans.
Hey, hey. It was Daryl on the drums. So the fun part of that song is hopefully somebody would dance, and then when we change tempos, they get a little confused, but it didn't happen, so we were fine. You were, you were, oh, you were smoking, okay. We gotta do one more and we'll take a little short, short break. All right, we're going to go deep into the funk world. So, there's so many jokes in my head, I'm not going to say any of them. This is by Sly and the Family Stone.
note on the drums. We're gonna take a tiny little break. Yeah, a little short. But we're playing right till four yeah. and not one minute past four. Why? Because the game is on. Go Bills. Yeah. Alright, now we're ready. This tune is called Smoking at Tiffany's. So I assume this is before breakfast. Thank you. 
having fun. I'm having too much fun. We were trying to save songs because we were supposed to have a couple guitar player friends come in, but they haven't shown up, so we might just have to do those songs without them. All right, here's an obscure one. How many people remember, I forget the number of the radio station, but it was I think it was called The Wave, that smooth jazz, when all that smooth jazz was coming around in the late 80s. This is one of the songs that was like, on probably every three hours they played this song. It's a, a, by Anita Baker. Actually, I want everybody to give a big hand to Tony running sound. Yeah. He has been amazing getting everything we needed done with the keyboards and everything. Thank you, Tony. And another round of applause for Sportsman's for having us. Yeah. They, they weren't going to have any music today, and they squeezed us in before the game. So we really appreciate that. Subtitles 
That's Anita Baxley on the keyboards. I need a, Anita. I need a drink. If I married Anita Baker, her name would be Anita Nut. That's cool. I, I used to work with a lady named Anita Plummer, no joke. <laughs> if I married Ivana Trump, and my, her name would be Ivana Nut. Ivana Nut. <laughs> Sorry, Lisa, you've heard all of these. <laughs> I do want to thank my beautiful, wonderful girlfriend that's here, Lisa Brandt. Big hand for Lisa, Lisa for putting up with me. And See, I snore, so she hasn't slept all week. Yeah, I feel bad. I snore when I'm awake, though. That's what's weird about it. <laughs> How do you do that? Yeah, okay, okay. So, this, this next one is, uh, Daryl and I sort of like got in this contest. The, the, like, it's the only way I know how to put it. Like, <laughs> well, it was like, we like to, to mess with each other, like during the gig, like musically, like just to see if we could trip each other up. See, let's see what we can do. So, so this one is like the, a contest to see who can uh, sign and seal and deliver it faster or better or with more uh, steps. <laughs> You got my future 
cat and mouse game. Now we're gonna do something a little bit more up tempo. An old okay. Steely Dan. Some old Dan. that song Dreamweaver? Yeah. yeah, we don't do that. But what we do do, <laughs> yeah, yeah, what we, we do do <laughs> is the other hit that he had, that Gary Wright had. You guys like Brown Eyed Girl? Yeah, we don't do that. <laughs> Mustang Sally? Nope, we don't do that. No, nope, we don't do that. Freebird? We do it, but it sounds like Jamiroquai. Yeah, it's, it's, it's weird. It comes out sounding like something else. So here's a song by Gary Wright.
Okay, so now, thank you very much. So now we're going to do something we call You Pick the Jam, and we need some help from the audience for this one. Oh, boy. So, let's see. I will pick on my friend Robin. You knew it was coming. No, you don't need to know anything. You're going to help us. We're going to draw out of you what we need. So we, for this song, we're going to write a song in front of you guys with your help. So we need a subject matter from you, Robin. Any subject in the world. Anything. It could be as simple or as complex as you like. High school. That's a good one. Okay, so the subject matter is high school. So... We will pick on, let's huh. see, Shirley. So give me a number from 1 to 127, and any number in between that, and that'll be the number of the patch, the sound that Matt has to use no matter what it is. It could be a dog bark, it could be a trumpet. Whatever it is, Matt has to use it. So from 1 to 127. What is it? No, you don't pick an instrument, you pick a number. 26? 76. 70. 70. So that's got to be your sound. 70? 70. So whatever it is, that's what we get. Okay, candy. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, we need you to help us with the tempo. So is it going to be fast, medium, Slow or sexy slow? Of Everybody course. picks sexy slow. Okay, sexy slow. See, <laughs> how can you? Everybody just want to say sexy. And Paul, I'm gonna not pick on you. Amy, your wife. What style of music would you like us to put in the middle of this song? Any genre of music at all? What is it? Reggae. Reggae. Okay. So, oh, somebody said no. <laughs> Reggae it is. So we have number 70 on the keyboard. The high, high school is the topic. Sexy slow and then go into reggae. So that's our song. So you guys are helping us with this song. Thank you. No idea how that's going to go because you're... Okay, so, so we're... All right, so just to recap here because I was uh, doing some things. Yeah, I wasn't paying attention at my own gig. Um, no, I was busy uh, getting sound number 70, which is this lovely sound right here. Yeah, so we get a, a, a lovely high school song with an English horn solo in it. And uh, that's going to be lovely. And it's sexy slow. I'm going to try to make an English horn be sexy some kind of way. And we're doing reggae, right? In some, at some point. <laughs> okay. You see? 
say it was the same year Oh And I was standing right next to you In our graduation photo So, because all you guys wrote that, you don't yeah. get any royalties, just so you know. That's, that's on us. We get that. We can have waivers for you to sign on the way out the door. <laughs> Thank you. That was fun. Okay. So, one of my favorite singers of all time is Mr. Steely Dan. He's, uh, he's, right, up, he's right up there with like, other great singers like, like Pink Floyd and... Uh, Hootie from Hootie and the Blowfish, and uh, who else? Uh, uh, Toad from the Wet Sprocket, and uh, yeah. Like, but anyway, yeah, we like Steely.
going to do an instrumental called the chicken. Sort of like buffalo wings, chicken. It all kind of goes together. Yeah? Chicken with Frank's hot sauce on. Yeah. There we go. Gotta have Frank's. Thank you. 
All right, Daryl. of equipment up here that I haven't really touched yet because I was having a bit of difficulty there in sound check. It's, it's this thing that makes this noise like this. When I talk and I play chords and it sounds like I've got other people sounding, I don't know, making... Hello. It seems to be working now, Tony. And my favorite thing is when he solos with it. So I'm going to give it a shot. All right. Here's another Steely Dan song. It's the one that goes. 
Awesome, guys. Thank you so much for coming out. Woohoo! Barker people, musician people, people we don't know people. We're going to do one more song and then call it a sportsman's success. How's that? <laughs> I'd like to say thanks again to everybody for, uh, for being so cool to me. And uh, I'm definitely not from, from, from Western New York, but uh, you all have treated me like I'm from here. And uh, everybody's, everybody's been just like so cool. And... Uh, I gotta come back because it's like great. This is a great place. I will be back before 30 years is up. I'm thinking about next year, so that'll be fun. Yeah, I heard you guys don't have hurricanes up here. That's, that's kind of a plus. Here's a song that we have never, ever heard another band cover, so the fact there's only two of us trying to do it is even more fun. Well, thank you. You are awesome. So here's a song by Jamiroquai.
now there's a real slow sound For me up in front of the ground, yeah Gotta end it on a major chord Thank you so much, everybody, for having us. Hope you have a great rest of your day. Yeah, thank you, Give guys. it up for Buffalo Music Hall of Fame inductee, Daryl Nutt. Thank you very much. My name's Matt Baxley. Very grateful. It's been a pleasure being here. Thank you to the sportsmen. Jason, thank you, man.